Hello everyone, this is Dickler, UTV2 stage rental transparent screen, commonly used for stage performances, festivals and so on. The biggest feature is its lightness. The overall weight is about 7.5 kilograms. As you can see, it's still very easy to lift. A girl like me can handle it easily. The cabinet has a transparency rate of 40%. Another advantage of the UTV2 product is it's waterproof. It can handle extreme weather perfectly. This is the smaller version of our UTV2. 500 times 500. Special stage designs like curves and right angles. Can be used more flexibly than large cabinet. Now let's take a look at the back structure. Look, UTV2 transparent screen back structure. This is a combination of handles and locks. Designers do ergonomic designs specifically. As we grab the handle and lift it up again, you can complete the locking operation with one hand. Here is curvature lock. The curvature lock has an adjustable range of 15 degrees, one scale every five degrees. Middle lock is also called safety lock. It can ensure that when splicing screens, more solid and reliable. This is one of our handles. There is a rebound design. It ensures easier and quicker handling. When placing it into an flight case and hanging screen, will not affect our normal operations. This is our power box. The power box dissipates heat from the side to the front. Larger heat dissipation area, left and right lock. When splicing left and right, it takes only two steps to complete. Push and press the locks like this. Do the same thing again. Very convenient and flexible. Unlock is also very convenient. Lift up. Just press the shrapnel and it will be fine. Easily complete. When we hanging and splice it, the overall feeling is very relaxed. A girl like me can handle it easily. When you lift the cabinet, the lock will be exposed naturally. When splicing it up and down, give it a wrench to the left. The lock has been completed. The one in the middle is a safety lock. Lock it and hold it in place. Overall, it is very convenient to operate alone. Now we start unlocking. Positioning pin. The positioning pin is pressed upward. If you twist it this way, it becomes working. If you unlock it, twist it back. Just loosen it up. Here are the positioning beads. Our designers deliberately combine these two methods. Apply to the same cabinet. Purpose is to make the splicing accuracy of the box higher. Thank you for watching.